Hello, my name is Claire Sullivan and I'm a scholar with the Data Incubator in Washington, D.C. I live right now in central Illinois, but I wanted to talk about my capstone project for the Data Incubator, which will combine my two loves, which are data science and skiing. The ski industry, like all industries, are collecting a lot of data on their customers. This data is being used to drive marketing decisions as well as to provide a better user experience. For instance, this social media site, Epic Mix, is a site that I used when I was skiing one of the Vail resorts and it uh, uses the RFID within my lift ticket to monitor things like how many runs I did, how much vertical I did, as well as link pictures to my account. Ski resorts like Vail collect all of this information because they have recognized that in changing snowfall years, they need to make their business about more than snowfall. In fact, this year, with the record low snowfalls in the Sierra Nevadas, they actually only lost 15% of their business, even though snowfall had declined by 80%. The way this happened is that Vail was able to get their skiers to purchase season passes well before the season started and before they knew what the snowpack was going to be. The research shows that if you can get a skier to ski your area for four to six days, that they, are, uh, they have an increased likelihood of purchasing that season pass. So can we use any historical data to help ski areas understand and predict what their snowpack is going to be before the season to help drive their marketing of their season passes? I propose to use commercial Landsat imagery to study snowpack dating back to 1970 and analyze these trends uh, over time, these snowpack trends.